What is going on everyone? Joe here today and I have a question for you all. Are you ready to hear the sound of my voice? Are you ready to experience the aroma of rebellion and seduction? Because both of these will be involved in the making of this review. There's your Tony Iommi Monkey Special. This is the general released version, the mainstream version. They also have a limited edition version. Both bottles were released in 2021 in collaboration with the Black Sabbath guitarist, Tony Iommi. I've been on the hunt for this fragrance for two years, ever since I first experienced it. Actually, I've been on the hunt for this fragrance ever since I first saw it, thanks to two friends of mine, Raph, Raphael and Rico from Fragged Out Swagged Out. Rico and I every year do this collaboration with Josh from Essential Notes that basically we highlight our like best purchases and like standout fragrances, everything like that. Every single year on Instagram, we will be doing that again this year too. This fragrance was on his list, but Rico had the special edition version. Always intrigued and then a few hours later, Raphael showed me and he too had this fragrance and I was on the hunt for it. So this video is two years in the making. Thankfully in time, I've had a chance to try and wear it to really see if this is something I would enjoy and it only increased my desire to acquire a bottle that much more. <laughs> and now, it's finally in my collection. Upon application, I'm getting some bergamot and this exotic semi-sweetness. Now this sweetness isn't from like a vanilla or anything. It's from a semi-fruity twang to it. And come to find out it was passion fruit. Now that dissipates very quickly. I mean, very quickly and it immediately transitions into this spicy patchouli thing backed by cinnamon and then immediately adds the addition of rum, leather, and some musk and woods in the mix. It's a semi-floral sweetness to it too and that is done with just the oh so slight touch of a rose great touch and i think that gets under appreciated in this fragrance just because of so many more heavy notes within the composition this fragrance is a powerhouse it lasts a very long time i was getting a solid nine to ten hours with it <laughs> at the least and it performed very well projected no problem but at the same time never had to announce itself the profile like this ideally fall and winter for this fragrance is what i would recommend but you could still get away with this on a date night or a night out men 25 and up really anyone 25 and up unless you just are a Tony Iommi Black Sabbath fan and appreciate the music and you have like a darker edge to you, maybe you could get away with 21. But I think the incorporation of the rum makes this a little bit more mature. Though unisex, I see it more masculine with the rum and leather. But if a woman wants to channel her inner femme fatale, black dress, red lipstick by all means i condone it go ahead box and presentation so if you haven't purchased a zhuzhov before most of them come in a box similar to this it will have the name of the fragrance in this case monkey special then you have zhuzhov tony iomi and the size of the bottle in the milliliters right there Zhuzhov, Tony Iommi, an excerpt. And once you remove the box, it comes in this amazing coffret. 
Most judge off stew. Great stitching. X is printed there. This one has it in silver. Judge off printed right there. The entire coffret. And as you open it, voila, there's your fragrance. Two other additions that were a part of this particular collaboration is this pamphlet book that has just some backstory on Tony Iommi, how the fragrance was made to be, and this because Tony Iommi was the lead guitarist for Black Sabbath. I thought this was a nice touch to have a guitar pick. I don't know if it would work on an actual guitar, but <laughs> I just thought that this was a really nice addition to the entire thing. Zhuzh off, Tony Ion. Model and presentation. So again, I mentioned before, there are two versions of this collaboration. This one, and then 200 bottles were made in a all black print with gold trim and would contain Tony Iommi's signature. This one, the general release one, has monkey heads printed around the bottle. As for the sprayer, really good, whatever you're afraid. So there you have it. There are my unaverage thoughts on Tony Iommi's monkey special. Congrats and bravo to Tony Iommi to Sergio, to anyone involved in the production of this masterpiece. And I know what you're probably thinking, if you are inquiring about wanting a bottle, it's getting a little bit harder to find. So I will also say this, if you liked YSL's tuxedo, you will like this. You do not smell the same, but they have a similar tone with overlapping notes. In my opinion, this is the pinnacle of that scent profile. In the comments below, let me know what your favorite Black Sabbath songs are. If you've tried and enjoyed Tony Iommi, Monkey Special. If you like any other Zhuzh Off fragrances, know what to do. Leave it in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. My name's Joe. I will see you in my next video.